On World Environment Day, let's reflect upon our relationship with nature. Food, medicine, water, clothing, and everything we consume come from our planet's biodiverse ecosystems. Over 80% of our diet is provided by plants. Fish alone provide 20% of animal protein to around 3 billion people. Our ecosystems also provide us with pollution control, storm protection, shoreline stabilization, erosion and flood control, and habitats for all species. Globally, marine and terrestrial ecosystems capture 60% of human carbon dioxide emissions. Yet with each passing day, we are losing biodiversity. Our forests, wetlands, and coral, and the ecosystem services they provide. Around 1 million species currently face extinction, and extinction rates continue to increase. Biodiversity loss also results in higher transmission of diseases. Land conversion and wildlife trade increasingly bring humans into contact with new diseases. Safeguarding biodiversity can help reduce future health risks, making our societies more resilient. Government support to fossil fuels, agricultural practices, and fisheries practices that are potentially harmful to biodiversity are at least five times larger than the finance that is spent to protect biodiversity. We need more ambitious and better aligned policies to protect biodiversity. COVID-19 is a powerful messenger with a powerful message. The message is our system is broken and we cannot go back to business as usual. We need to build new economic systems that value nature as a central source of our health and our well-being. Together, let's protect our biodiversity to ensure the well-being of our planet and the life it supports.